Hello, my name is Torina KDJ and I wrote a book called Ladies Let's Be Frank. I talk about three different areas, love, singleness, and marriage. And one of the chapters in my book is dedicated to love. I really wanted to find out what the true definition of love is. So I asked girls questions like, how do you know you love this person? And I'll get answers like, oh my gosh, he makes me so happy and ties my shoelaces for me and makes me ice cream. And Okay, they might not use those exact same words, but you get the idea. And I just kept thinking, okay. After a while, it started sounding a little shallow and selfish to me. So, my search led me to 1 Corinthians 13, where it talks about love is patient, love is kind. And it seemed like it was just all about the other person and all about giving to someone else. It had nothing to do with me. And I just kept thinking, all those girls who have explanations like, he ties my shoelaces for me and all that. I keep thinking, what if he stops doing all that? Will they stop loving him or will they fall out of love with him? And if we say love is given, is that really true? Because that doesn't sound too popular. It doesn't sound too appealing to my ears, really. And then I thought of another example. When a baby is born into this world, the baby can't do jack squat. All the baby can do is Google Gaga or anything like that. And the mom just loves this child. At least most moms love their baby. And the baby can't even say, Mom, thank you for changing my diapers or loving me or taking care of me. They just love that child. And when I think of loving my family, I don't have a reason why I love them. It's just a fact. I just love them. So next time you think you're in love with someone, just really think, are you really in love with that person? Are you really trying to give to that person? You can get a copy of my book at ladieslesbefrank.com or wordclay.com. And I'd like to hear your comments and hear what you think. Thank you.